Hey guys, happy day 114, Captain's Log, July 7th, 2020. Look, I got a little hair escaping over there. Let's push that back there. Hey, listen, for those of you that uh, watch my show and make comments about my hat, look, I don't have a sticker on this hat or nothing, right? What do you guys think about that? Um, let's start with some birthday shout outs. Uh, you know, I mentioned my uh, good friend, former manager, uh, Mark, the most interesting man in the world. Um, and he has a partner in crime. All the adventures I hear about him, uh, Jan is by his side. I just want to say to her today, happy birthday. I hope you're doing well. We haven't chatted in some time. Um, hope you're being safe. And I hope you and Mark are, uh, are doing good. Uh, also, some celebrity birthdays. Uh, Ringo Starr, Guy's got to be like in his 80s or something. I don't know. Uh, Shelly Duvall. The reason I brought her up is The Shining. You know, a great classic movie, The Shining. Um, and then also Satchel Paige. I think he was born like in 1907. It's a while back. But uh, Satchel Paige was also born on this day. Also, uh, in 1947, this day in history, is where the UFO Roswell incident happened. Roswell is synonymous, I think, with UFOs and, and body snatching or, you know, encounters or whatever it is, Roswell. Um, and that happened in 1947. And to this day, when you hear Roswell, that's exactly what you think of. It's actually exactly what I think of anyway. But um, 1947. Also got a message uh, from a family member that said that 248 is not Detroit's area code. It's 313. So I apologize. The big D, the 313. I guess I got to watch that uh, eight mile movie to uh, really have it sink in. But anyway, uh, thanks for reaching out, guys. Just want to chat with you guys today about the new norms. So I sell real estate. So in my business, I'm meeting lots of people. I'm in front of lots of people. And one of the two things that you always do, right, is you shake their hand. And you normally you hand them a business card, you know, depending on, you know, whatever. Today, I met with a new client um, with masks on, the whole bit, social distance. But we didn't shake hands. And um, I didn't hand him a business card because we're not supposed to be handing things to, you know, property statements, nothing. None of that stuff can. It was just, it felt kind of awkward, to be honest with you, uh, not to shake his hand when I met him for the first time um, and not to hand him a business card, you know, you know, as a follow up, you know, here's my information. Da, da, da. It just felt different. And I guess I'm going to have to get used to it. I guess maybe we're all going to have to get used to it. The handshaking and the uh, handing out cards and handing out things and different things. You know, we went to a couple restaurants, as I mentioned, and those were Took a picture of a QR code and the, the menu popped up on your screen. There was a restaurant I went to uh, just for lunch with my daughter because we were out taking care of some stuff. And uh, they handed me a paper menu, but they threw the paper menu away. I mean, it was, you know, it might have just been a Xerox, right? But once we used it, it was gone. Um, I would have to say, I like touching the menu and there's, you know, there's more real estate. You can kind of see everything. But I think it's just more efficient to have it on your phone, right? A menu on your phone. You can scroll and da da da. Maybe they can link it to what it, the, what the dish looks like. Um, I'm just starting to wrap my head around some of the new norms that we're all going to have to get used to. And again, I, I don't get me wrong. I hear this from a lot of my friends and, and family from across the country. It, we're overdoing it. It's it's not a, as big of a deal as we're making it to believe. Whatever they may say or feel or believe. Um, I just think society is going to be shifting. There's going to be a shift in how we work and how we play and how we interact. And the first thing may be the handshake. Maybe that's going away. And I, I know it's been talked about a couple times uh, over the last 114 days. Um, is it going to be the elbow tap? Is it going to be a fist? Even the fist is probably no good, right? Maybe an elbow tap or just a, just a wave. I'm going to have to get used to it for sure because as soon as I met the guy, you know, I, I had to pull back my arm. I was like, whoa, sorry about that. Um, and we both laughed about it. But 
Yeah, the new norm, the new reality. Anyway, it's Tuesday. I hope you guys had an amazing day. It is a beautiful evening. Uh, my house faces east, so I don't get to see the sunset. I get to see the sunrise, uh, but I can see the beautiful colors in the sky. So I bet if I was at the beach right now, it would be fantastic. So again, happy birthday, Jan. Thinking of you. And uh, here's to the hashtag 313. No stickers on the hat. You guys, thank you so much for watching. Tomorrow, I'm going to show you a video of one of my new listings. It's a walkthrough. I held the camera a little bit shaky. I got to buy, uh, I got to replace my uh, gimbal. And uh, hopefully, we'll study those shots for you. But anyway, thanks again for watching. You guys take care. Happy Tuesday. We'll see you tomorrow. Hump day. 415 together. 415 strong. 313-248-707-808. Bye, guys.